Tigers are large, powerful, and aquatic big cats known for their distinct striped coat and incredible strength. Here are some key facts about tiger species. There are several subspecies of tigers, with the most well known being the Bengal tiger, Siberian tiger, Sumerian tiger, Malayan tiger, and more. Each subspecies has its own unique characteristics and habitat. Tigers are primarily found in the variety of habitat including forest, grassland, mangrove swamp across Asia. They are highly adaptable animal but require access to sufficient prey and water source. Tigers have a bright orange coat with dark vertical stripe which serve as a camouflage in their natural environment. To underside of their body is white and they have a distinct white spot on the back of the ears. Tigers are the largest of the big cat species. Adult tigers can range in size with male typically being a large than females. They can weigh around from 100 to 300 kilograms, can grow to length of 4.5 to 4 meters, including their tail. Tigers are solitary animals and are known for their stealth and hunting power. They are carnivorous, primarily preying on deer and other large mammals. Tigers are known for their ability to stalk and ambush their prey. Tigers are endangered with their population decline due to the habitat loss, poaching and human wildlife conflict. Conservation efforts are in place to protect these magnificent creatures. Female tigers typically give birth to a little or two or four cubs which they raise on their own. Cubs are born blind and rely on their mother for food and protection. Tigers hold a special place in the various cultures and are often associated with strength, power and courage. They are the national animals of several countries including India and Bangladesh. Efforts to protect and conserve tigers in the wild are ongoing through the various organizations and government initiative as these magnificent creatures are at risk of disappearing if not properly preserved and protected. A tiger bite is a dangerous and potentially life-threatening injury. Tigers are among the largest and the most powerful big cats. Tiger bite is extremely powerful due to its large size and strong jaws. The bite force of a tiger is among the highest of all the land mammals. This means that a tiger bite can cause several injuries including broken bones and massive tissue damage. A tiger bite can be fatal if it targets vital organ or arteries. The combination of powerful jaws, sharp teeth and strong muscle makes their bite highly effective in immobilizing and killing prey. In the wild tigers use their powerful bite to subdue and kill their prey, typically large mammals like deer and wild bear. The bites are adapted for hunting and survival. Encounters between the tiger and the humans are extremely dangerous. Wild tigers are typically fearful of humans and avoid them, but if provoked or concerned, they can attack it two or centuries if they feel threatened or provoked. If someone is bitten by a tiger, immediate media medical attention is crucial. Tiger bite can result in several injuries and infection due to bacteria in the tiger's mouth. Treatment may involve wood cleaning, antibiotics and survival intervention if necessary. The best way to avoid tiger bite is to keep a safe distance from a wild tiger and to follow the safety protocol when dealing with captive tiger control environment. It is important to emphasize that interacting with tigers, especially in the wild, can be extremely dangerous and is often illegal due to conservation efforts to protect these endangered animals. If you encounter a tiger in the wild, it's advised to maintain safe distance and avoid provoking or disturbing the animal. Tigers are wild animals and they are generally not domesticated or naturally friendly towards humans. Tiger in the wild is solitary and exclusive creatures that primarily interact with their tiger and their behavior is driven by their instinct and need for survival. 
Interacting with wild tiger can be extremely dangerous and is often illegal and highly discouraged due to the risk it poses in both the humans and the tiger. In contrast, there are cases where tiger is captivity such as those in reputable zoos or wildlife sanctuaries may appear more habitual to human, but still they are not considered friendly. In the same way domesticated animals might be even in captivity, they should be treated with a caution and respect. They are still powerful predators with natural instinct. It is essential to remember that tigers are not domesticated animals and attempt to keep a tiger as a pet to have a close interaction with one can lead to dangerous situation for both humans and animals. Responsible wildlife management and conservation practices focus on protecting and preserving these majestic creatures in their natural habitat and ensuring their well-being in captivity while minimizing the human contact for safety reasons. Yes, tigers can be dangerous to humans. Tigers are among the largest and the most powerful big cats. They have the ability to cause serious harm or even death to humans. If they feel threatened, concerned or provoked in the wild, tigers are generally shy and avoid humans' contact. But if they started or feel endangered, they may attack in self-defense. Human-tiger conflicts can occur in areas where human population encroach upon tiger habitat. Tigers may venture into human settlement in search of food, which can lead to confrontation such humans. Situations can be extremely dangerous for both humans and tiger. Tigers can also be dangerous especially if they are not handled and cared for properly. Even tigers in zoo or wildlife sanctuaries which are more accommodized to humans' presence can exhibit unpredictable behavior. It is essential to treat the captive tigers and with great care and respect to minimize the risk associated with close contact. There are many tigers of species like and can be found in the many regions like tropical rainforests, mixed grassland forests, Siberian tiger, mangrove swamps, dry grassland scrubs, and Himalayan mountains. Now, there can be many tiger species as you know it. Like there are several subspecies of tiger with its own unique characteristics and range. Historically, they were recognized with tiger subspecies.